Hello everyone. Most of the people, when they are looking at this type of equation, they try to find the easiest way. So in this case, what they try to find, they try to cancel most of the threes. So they cancel these ones, three divided by three, which is one. Then they cancel these ones, three divided by three, which is one as well. So what they have in the end is one divided by one. We can keep the parentheses divided by three. So here again, it's canceling. So we have one divided by three, which is one third. But this, of course, is incorrect. If you remember, PEMDAS, which P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponents, M for multiplication and division, and NA for addition and S for subtraction. In our case, we don't have parentheses, we don't have exponents, we don't have multiplication, but we have division. So when we have multiplication and or division, we need to do everything from left to write. So in our case, the correct solution of this equation would be we have three divided by three, okay, is one. We have then we write what's left, one divided by three, divided by three, and all this divided by three. So in this case, we have a fraction. So one divided by three, it's one, one third. One third divided by three, Let's keep it as it is, divided by three. When we have a fraction and a division, we must remember the key SF rule, which means keep the first, change the sign, and then flip the third one. What we get is one third. So we keep the first, we change the sign to multiply, and we flip the second one. So we have one third, all this divided by third. Here it's one ninth. So we have one ninth divided by three. And here we apply the same rule. We keep the first, we multiply, we change the sign and we flip the, the second one. So we have one ninth multiply by one third which is one over 27. And of course, guys, this is the correct answer. One over 27. Thank you very much for watching. Please hit the like button and subscribe uh, for more videos. Ciao, ciao.